Okay, I'm here with Anna. Say hi, Anna. Hi. And tell us what we've built today. A telegraph. Huh. A wireless telegraph. A wireless telegraph. And uh, how does that it works by doing what? By sending electromagnetic waves. Aha! Can you can you demonstrate for me? So I can see uh, I can see there's a flashing light down here, some kind of sparking going on. Do that again. Right? But I also hear something. Mm -hmm. I can hear this buzzing, tinkle tink. Mm -hmm. But I hear something over that way. Uh, and what is that that I'm hearing? The radio. The radio, right? It's on an AM dial and it's apparently picking up something that we're generating. Try it again. Mm -hmm. Right. So uh, tell me what's going on here. So the ele electrons mm -hmm. are going from this all the way through here. Mm -hmm. To this one, which makes its way to this side, mm -hmm. which goes through this wire mm -hmm. to here. Right. And whenever this is held down, is that a switch? Yes. And there's a gap there. So when you hold it down, aha, uh -huh, okay. Then it goes to here. Right. And then this makes it. Um, this goes to here. Right. The electrons continue through that copper wire. Um, to this side, and it goes down. Right, and it connects what? It connects to this green wire. Uh huh. And then it wraps around all the way through here. Now, what's what's going on there? What is that wrapping around? It's business? wrapping around a uh, part of a nail. Okay, so it's got a steel or iron core, mm -hmm. right? And it's wrapping around there. And then what happens to the electrons? Where do they go? It goes back uh -huh. to here. Yep, and back into the battery. Mm -hmm. Okay, awesome. And uh, so, you want to demonstrate again for me? All right. So why are there why are there sparks coming out here? What's going because on there? Because this is going up and down. And why is that going up and down? Because the um, when you hold this down, uh -huh. it goes here uh -huh. all the way back around, and it makes a it goes around, uh -huh. which causes it to go. Down. Right, and when the electrons go through the wire around and around this steel core, this becomes what? We call that an electromagnet, right? Mm -hmm. So it becomes magnetic, and you're saying that it then pulls this down? Yes. Okay, great. Well, then why doesn't it stay down? Because it has, because it, it stops. It stops, yeah. Because we've created a gap here, right? Mm -hmm. So that we've broken the circuit. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Okay, great. So then what happens? Just, it goes back up. Mm -hmm. Okay. Keeps going. All right, great. And why is there a spark? Why am I seeing a spark? <clears throat> because um, it's going up and down really fast. Mm -hmm. And because the electrons are actually jumping through the air mm -hmm. across this gap here. Yeah. Okay. And um, so you're saying that the sparks then cause the electromagnetic waves? Mm -hmm. Why is that? We don't know, okay, but somehow the acceleration of the electro uh, electrons mm -hmm. is generating electromagnetic waves. Mm -hmm. What's this yellow wire here? This is um, a lot of alligator clips strung together, right? Which is making an antenna. Makes an antenna, right? And and does the antenna actually go over and touch the radio? No. It doesn't. It goes. Close to the radio, we just clipped it up there. Okay, close to the radio. All right, mm -hmm. and we sort of found out that if we don't have it close to the radio, it probably won't, won't make it that far, yeah. right? Okay, you want to go demonstrate for me one more time? Sure. Awesome. Okay, thank you very much.